Hey guys, welcome back to Abbey Reviews and today we're going to be doing an unboxing of a bubble machine. So I suppose the backstory to this is we've always purchased, you know, the cheaper bubble machines at Kmart and other places. And, you know, to be fair, a few uses and that thing just dies and it's not even that cheap. Like you're talking about 20, 20 up to $25 sometimes for at least this kind of really plasticky, colorful machine. It also uses batteries and it kind of just generates bubbles for the kids, right? So I'm not holding this massive stick and trying to blow it all the time, right? But anyways, I decided to invest in something a bit more sturdy. It's still plasticky, um, but hopefully it solves the problem. So this cost around $45. I purchased it at DJ City. Um, and the machine, the brand is AVE or AV, I don't know how to pronounce it, but it's called Bubble Mania Bubble Machine, right? It looks metal. So I think one call out is the people at DJ City just didn't know enough about this. So they were like, oh no, get this one. It's a metal one. It has a power cable. Really full upselling, even trying to get me to buy the bubbles. But anyways, they were the only place that kind of sold it. So you just have to deal with some of those customer service sometimes. Anyways, here, here's the machine. Whoa. Oh, right. right. Get this down. Get the power cord. I like the power cord because I feel like adding the extra ten dollars to the base model that I saw, um, it was just worth it. Um, mainly because batteries are just expensive. I could buy rechargeable batteries, but I just like being able to plug to the mains and especially because I have a power point outside, it works perfectly for my situation. Uh, inside here, you also get these two little bits. These little bits as well. And there to attach the handle. So it's going to make it very portable and nice and easy to carry. Um, this whole thing, it looks metal, but it's very plasticky. And this thing just basically spins. You can already see this plastic part is already just snapping as well, so that's a bit frustrating. Um, I don't know how long this is going to hold out. It's very, very cheaply made, but, you know, hopefully it's a lot better than the other cheap stuff I buy from Kmart. Uh, it's just this kind of wheel that spins and it picks up all the solution down here. It's got the logos on the back. It's got a fan. Once you turn it on, it's going to blow and essentially simulate what a human will do. Some of the downfalls to this, it's a bit hard to see, but on the side, the screws come in through the side here. And it actually sticks out really sharp bits on the inside here, which just super poor design. Right? But anyways, let's test this out. I purchased myself two liters of bubble mix solution from Kmart and that was about $7.50 so hopefully this would you know make the kids stay so now that this is assembled essentially putting the handle on plugging the power cable in not much assembly needed all you have to do is pour some solution mix in As I can probably already see, some of the downfalls is that this actual tray where the solution mix, it's actually not removable. So you're gonna have to kind of wash with this whole thing attached, which can be a bit frustrating. So here we are outside, machines plugged in. Not a very long cable, probably about one meter there. Um, let's hit this power switch and see this thing in action. Oh, this is pretty cool. Oh, the kids are going to love this. So, um, I know it's only, you know, just started. It looks amazing already. So, I'm super excited uh, for the kids, I think. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully this has helped. Feel free to kind of ask any questions. As you can hear, it's not very loud as well. It's quite silent, so that's kind of nice. And look at the bubbles. It's going crazy with the bubbles hope this video helps um, leave any kind of comments below if you have any questions and hit that like and subscribe button thanks guys